Today we have Mr. Romit Sharma who secured All India Rank 1 in Engineering Service Exam 2023 with a Mechanical Engineering stream. So we will get the information about the success story. Okay, Mr. Romit, uh, uh, briefly introduce yourself. Uh, sir, I belong from Palampur, Himachal Pradesh. I have done my schooling from uh, Palampur as well as from Chandigarh. Uh, for undergraduation, I have done uh, mechanical engineering from Thapar University. Uh, very I have been gold medalist in Thapar University itself. Uh, mm -hmm. And afterwards, I started preparation for civil services examination. Wow. Ah. But 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 after repeated uh, uh, lack of but after repeated failure, I shifted to engineering services examination to my core subject, mm -hmm. and this was my second attempt. In the first attempt in 2018, I was able to clear the prelims, but could not uh, was not able to give the mains exam because of some uh, preoccupations at home. Uh, so this was the uh, attempt uh, with which I prepared wholeheartedly, and I was able to uh, secure a good rank. What were your uh, optional subjects uh, in uh, civil services means? Uh, mechanical. Mechanical. So that is yeah. why you are able to continue the. Uh, 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 yes, sir. I was able to make a transition, but sir, uh, my serious preparation was uh, around uh, one year back. It started one year back only. Okay, okay. Before so that, I was to... before okay. that I was mostly indulged in general studies subjects. Uh -huh. So I am very happy to know that you have taken online live classes, online test series, and interview yeah. guidance program. So coming to the preparation strategy of prelims, please with respect to general studies and technical paper. So first, I uh, first uh, I would say that the strategy world is it a uh, word is itself very uh, heavy. There was no such uh, I would say uh, special attention that I give to that word. The my funda was very clear. I have to cover all the subjects. All the subjects. Okay. I have divided all the entire syllabus into basically eighteen different subjects. I have to cover each and every subject. Okay. But there, there definitely there are some subjects which are going to be my favorite. So I covered them exhaustively. For the other subjects, I uh, made cursory glance through them, through the previous year questions, through the coaching material. I did not uh, delve much into them. Mm -hmm. What so are your this, favorite subjects? Uh, sir, um, uh, especially this uh, thermal engineering and fluid mechanics and all these strength of material. Uh, mm. Basically, I, I will say production engineering is a bit uh, on a shaky status. Rest I can, I was able to manage easily. Anyway, for production, I don't think much weightage is there in engineering services. Yeah, yeah, yes, sir. I, you, but, but sir, I was a little bit uh, lack of, you can say, in, um, uh, preparation in that. So that was hampering the entire overall. Uh, yeah, yeah. Basically the syllabus is heavy in production engineering. Yes, sir. Okay. So how you could manage the time? Say, numerical questions are there. Definitely, calculator is not allowed. So. Hmm. What you have done with respect to numerical questions? So, uh, first, uh, you have to memorize the uh, formulas. That should be at your tips. First thing is that. Second is, it is better to join a prelims test series. Mm -hmm. And if a person cannot join a test series, all the tests, you should join at least full-length tests. Full that is the that is the best uh, that can give you the best evaluation. And mm. even if you are not able to attempt all the questions, I suppose you are you will be definitely able to attempt three fourths of the questions. You will definitely attempt. So test series is the I will say is the key role it will play in time management. Mm. Any elimination techniques you followed in the exam hall? No, no, sir. No, uh, 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 around uh, a few months back, I went through all these uh, topper stock where they mentioned about various elimination techniques and, and and everything. But sir, I find it extremely redundant. Either hmm. you know the question or you do not know the question. That's so I was right. able. Uh, yeah, if if your preparation is good, when whenever you see a question, immediately. An idea will stuck to your mind. You know this question, you do not know this question. If you know this question, it's better to attempt it. If you do not know this question, leave it and do not even think about it. So in the technical object to paper, paper two, I think technical object two, how many questions you attempted? Uh, sir, uh, I was able to uh, attempt almost uh, five questions. I was not able to attempt because of time paucity. Rest I was able to go through them go through the 
questions i was able to but sir again uh, the last five questions which i did not attempt after the exam i was able to solve them i found that they are very easy to solve so this happens so That's sorry right. anyway this uh, mains have you prepared the prelims and the mains together Definitely, paper. definitely, sir. Although there are many strategies, people say that prepare for prelims separately, prepare for mains separately. But sir, the syllabus is same. It is better to prepare both of them together. What I believe is that when you are uh, giving prelims examination, your preparation should be that it should cover the entire mains also, yeah. because after prelims, the focus should be on giving the test series and revision. If uh, if we leave. Uh, learning of new subjects after prelims, then it is going to be a difficult, very uh, difficult task. Uh, with respect to question come answer booklet, what is your uh, methodology? Uh, have you uh, selected uh, some of the questions? Means suppose in question one, there are four parts. Have you attempted all the four parts or uh, leaving some of the parts like that? So as I have told you earlier, if uh, a person has a command over the subjects, uh -huh. so the person would be easily able to identify the questions which he knows, which he does not know. Okay. So in my uh, in my case, I was able to go through the entire booklet, and in the five minutes, I was damn sure that I have to attempt these three these questions. I have to okay, attempt okay. these five questions. Okay. Now in the remaining questions, I did not even see them. I did not even touch them. There was a question regarding robotics. I made a cut on my question paper that I have not to even see that question and waste my time. Now, okay. regarding the five questions, so now the five questions that I have selected, there is there are some parts which I do not know the answer. For example, there was a question related to steam jet refrigeration system. So I was not able to even I I could not remember the I have not studied. I could not remember. So what I did, I just. Uh, completed all the other questions, so there was no such. Yeah, I have to complete one first, then two first. Whatever I was able to see the, yeah. whatever I finding easy, first I was completing. Stroke. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Exactly. Uh -huh. Very good strategy. Very good. Uh, it, it, it is not like that. I have to go through first question, then second, uh, then fourth, then fifth. No, what I know, I immediately solve it. You have gone through the entire paper within five minutes. Yes, sir. Sir, I'm telling you, once you have the knowledge of the subject, once you've completed your subjects, all the subjects, it is, becomes very, very easy. For example, if robotics was not my favorite subject and I have not even studied that subject in detail, I have gone through the PYQ and there, there is previous questions and I have, uh, I have very little knowledge. So I uh, straight away rejected all those questions. Why I have not... Break our head? <laughs> Yeah, exactly, sir. Mechatronics, robotics, solar energy. So these subjects are better to leave them. So focus on strength. That's all. Definitely, sir. Because because if 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 I were to uh, ruminate on these subjects, I cannot solve. So the time is getting also wasted. Okay, correct. Okay, coming to the interview, how much time you have spent in the interview board? As per what I felt, he. Uh, the duration of my interview was little less as hmm. compared to other members, which because out of Kitana five, Kitana yes, sir, I, believe, I believe 20 to 25 minutes, not more. Okay, than okay, okay, okay. So, okay. so uh, uh, after interview, there was a bit of a uh, lack of confidence. Ki I was not, I will not be uh, because the interview was very little, uh, sh short duration. So, I felt ki I was on a sh uh, shaky platform. So, I was mostly it is a rejection interview. Uh, how the interview proceeded? Uh, right from the chairman. Chairman, sir, what he has asked him. I mean, uh, first, uh, the chairperson was uh, uh, Dr. Suman. So, uh, I would say that the questions asked by the chairperson were of general nature. They were general studies questions uh, relating to solar energy. That's very general questions. Okay. So, I was able to answer them easily. Uh, uh, regarding the three panel members, they asked technical questions. Now, one panel member, uh, he basically grilled me on some mechanical topic, which I was not able to answer. So, I clearly told him that I was not able to answer. I do not know the. Um, regarding the remaining two panel members, I was able to satisfy them. Any questions on your personal issues, biodata, da? Uh, uh -huh, sir, only, only one question was there uh, regarding the this uh, gap. 
for your civil services yeah. preparation so the answer was my answer was also very generic it is not um, idealistic answer my answer was simple ki i could not uh, give uh, attention to um, if i were to join any job i could not give attention to both the things job as well as exam so i opted for exam and prepared and unfortunately not able to clear the exam i told them directly everything hmm. so uh, they have not cornered see administrative service is your first option ye second hai na kya hai bol ke <laughs> ne ne uh, actually sir uh, i would not compare these two things uh, administrative and engineering see if it is better to keep both of them on an equal pedestal one oh. is general and other is technical there is no sense of comparison between them the profile is entirely different it is just that what i feel is that uh, without lack of preparation you, are, you will not able to clear any exam my in case of civil services there was lack of preparation there was lack of direction so i will i will definitely never clear that exam in case of engineering that was my core subject my direction was good and fortunately the test series that i have joined so yeah. they were so helpful and definitely if these things all you are doing properly why not you will get a rank okay mr romit uh, uh, what is your message to juniors suppose they are in the btech second year or third year final year so that they can crack in the first or second attempts your suggestion please i said uh, so first of all i would say that keep prepare your subjects whatever you are doing do it, do it religiously you do not uh, always keep this in focus you have to clear the exam because as we know that engineering seats for mechanical um, engineering services examination mechanical engineering seats are reducing every year so so it is it is genuine ki people are getting bothered by that so i would say ki do not get bothered just prepare your subject whatever you are studying you are studying production you are studying thermal just focus on that because sooner or later this will matter in the exam so even if there is one vacancy it is for us likewise we have to think definitely if, if if you go into these things that the selection rate is very less or the exam is very difficult you are never able to you will never clear the exam it is better mm-hmm. to focus on the strength rather than on these redundant issues and i would say that if you are preparing for these exams it is better to join a test series at least these things will definitely guide you in the right direction you have the knowledge of the subject now you need to implement that in a particular direction so for that test series will definitely do you wonders what is the right time to start preparation for btech student second year third year or what it is nahi no, sir i would definitely say after fourth year because 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 i i am again telling that focus solely on the subject that you are studying matlab okay. do not do not keep on thinking that the syllabus of the engineering year gate is this much so i will study this much in the college if the if you are studying thermal engineering study everything not only from indian uh, curriculum as well as it fo- focused on especially foreign curriculum study that subject in detail do not keep on thinking gate and all that you can always join these coaching institutions definitely they will help you after the college okay thank you beta ah uh, all but the sir, best god bless you sir, once sir, again i would like to say one thing uh sir especially in case of as engineering i joined the mains online test series yeah. sir out of many test series i have joined for mains exam sir i would say the the constructive criticism i received in the as engineering test series that was very helpful in other test series i was getting very high mark uh, very high marks but in case of as i was not getting very high marks so it was a jolt it was a jolt from the blue for me ki i have to prepare in a good manner basically the 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 way of checking of the exam it is very strict it is not linear to please the student it is to give the reality check to the student and second as far as the interview guidance is concerned i would definitely say the panel played a very important role for example uh, if i if i talk about i was prepared with the mechanical subjects but i was not prepared with the general study subject i i, I have very uh, studied very little about these current affairs but the panel is especially told me to prepare in a holistic manner about the current affairs so before the interview as i was able to cover the current affairs no matter how much how little but i was able to clear the um, i gain sufficient confidence while i was sitting in the uh, front of upsc panel thank you ravi thanks for your appreciation convey our pranams namaste thank you sir thank you, thank thank you, you sir thank you all the best thank you. god bless you thank you, thank you sir thank you